What's up guys, I'm Alex with the Hollow Herald and today in this video we're, we're going to be going over our top 5 games on the HoloLens. So uh, let's go check them out. Number 5, Hollow Tower. Now this game is pretty much Jenga for the HoloLens, but I really enjoyed it. One thing that really surprised me was just how high quality and how high of a resolution the holograms had. Like each block um, pretty much had, was all detailed out. And it was very, very impressive just how much uh, care was put into each one. And I thought that was that was noteworthy. Another thing I really liked about this game that, that pretty much made it was how acute the physics effects were for, for the tower. As you move your hand, your actions pretty much uh, affect the entire tower, uh, determining whether it stays or if, if it'll fall and it, it teeters. Uh pretty much throughout and makes it makes it makes for a pretty intense game which I thought was very enjoyable number four the floor is lava now this game transforms your entire room be it office bedroom or kitchen into a deadly pool of lava and you have to use your wits and your surroundings to survive and pick up the little treats to gain points this game was a lot of fun and highly immersive and it entertained us for hours if you die in the game, you die in real life. Number three, Young Conquer. Now, this game actually received a lot of negative feedback and reviews. A lot of people said that it was nothing like the other uh, Conquer games, and that the HoloLens uh, would never be a, a good console or platform for video games. But I really don't feel like that's the point. I just kind of felt like Young Conquer was kind of there, to show off the capabilities and abilities of the HoloLens, and I feel like it did just that. It was a lot of fun to be able to play all the missions. There are a ton of missions, a ton of stuff to do, and it's really fun to interact with your little young, with the young Conquer, with this little character, because he talks to you, and you get to interact with him in, in various ways, and I had a very enjoyable time playing this game personally. Number two, Robo Raid. Now this game, personally, I found incredible. I had a blast, and it, it this Robo Raid turns your entire room into a battlefield where crazy, maniacal robots want to kill you, and you spend the whole game running around, dodging bullets, just trying to <clears throat> trying to survive, and I, I got a workout playing it. it. It was so much fun, and on the side, you can shoot very realistic holes in your in your walls, destroying your house while you're at it. And I enjoyed it. Very immersive, very intense. I would recommend this game to anybody. And for our number one spot on the list, Fragments. This game was incredibly addictive and a lot of fun. Now, to kind of give you the setting of it, it's a lot like Minority Report. Where you're trying to stop a crime from happening. And you have to interact with a whole bunch of people. And go through their memories. And solve puzzles and find clues to keep this crime from happening. And it was a lot of fun trying to figure everything out. And one of the one of the coolest details about this game is that the holograms of people will come in and they will sit on your couch, on your chairs, and they will talk to you. And you can interact with them in various ways. And it was really cool to be able to see that. And I feel like this game, why it got the number one spot is because it really unleashed the full potential of the HoloLens and just what games can do. And I feel like it really shows that, that the future is very, very promising for games on the HoloLens. All right, guys, that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. Those are our top five picks. Let us know if you have a game or have seen a game on the HoloLens that didn't make this list. And let us know why you think it should have. And as usual, like, subscribe, comment down below. Let us know what you think. Um, if you guys are interested, here pretty soon there's going to be a top five applications on the HoloLens that we'll be going over and give you guys something else to look at as well. So, hope you enjoyed it. Thanks so much. See you next time.